4.5 is out and I want to talk about phase one real quick. So um, it ends on April 2nd. There's, there are two events called one called the Chem Alchemical Ascension. It starts on March 14th, which is tomorrow, and it ends April 1st. And we'll also have the Great Phase Reaction, which starts on March 22nd and ends April 3rd. Um, given those dates, I'm imagining uh, second phase will be more event heavy. Or at least I hope so, given that the Great Phase Reaction is shorter than the Alchemical Ascension. But I don't know for sure. Um, in any case, 4.5 as a whole feels like a filler patch, honestly. There's not much there. I played last night. I gotta say I got lucky that in one of my baby accounts I got Klee on the 8th pull, which was really nice. So, um, if you can just throw a couple of wishes on the new banner and pull a character you want or a weapon you want, early on I he recommend you doing that just don't try to build pity on it because your pity will go away when the banner changes keep that in mind when it comes to Chiori here are my impressions of her number one she's the first real indisputable power creep in Genshin rip she's just a slightly better albedo and in some cases she's a much better albedo but she is still just Albedo, you know, and that's really sad for Albedo and um, for all of us because I wish Genshin did not have power creep. I got invested into Genshin because it did not have power creep. So seeing it happen for the first time is a little bit heartbreaking. I wish it didn't happen, you know. Um, as for Kyori herself, I think her dolls could have used a lot more voodoo. Um, they could have gone somewhere really cool with the dolls and made them creepy and interesting and have actual attack animations instead of just being there and the enemy is taking damage because they're there, which felt bad. On the positive, her normal attacks are awesome. They look amazing, but she is on a fielder. Why give such good normal attack animations to an off-fielder is beyond me. Everybody's gonna feel tempted to use her on-field. And I can see people making physical Kyori builds because of it. But her normal attacks do very little damage, so... Unfortunately, that's not gonna be very good. Um, Personally, I'm not pulling for her. I'm saving my wishes. Because, in my opinion, unless you're already heavily invested into Geo, she is a bad pull. Okay? I mean, she's a better pull than Albedo, because she basically power crapped Albedo. Um, but I would rather waste a few wishes on the new banner and get Albedo early on, than try to pull for her and mess up my wishing history for better 5 stars. Now, do keep in mind, I don't want Kazua or Nouvellet, because I already have Kazua on all of my accounts. And I don't really like Nouvellet, so I'm going to be saving my wishes for 4.6 and beyond, obviously. But yeah, those are my thoughts for 4.5, first phase. Um, if you're wishing for her, I wish you good luck. If you want Ito, good luck as well. Um... And if you're getting Ito, make sure to try and get some Goros on your way. Also her, honestly. Um, as for the other two, Dory and Yunjin, I don't really have any use for them personally. In any case, that was the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one. Please like and subscribe. Bye-bye.